Hey fam, I want you to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash Roland S. Martin. And don't forget to turn on your notifications. So we want to talk education with someone who you probably would say, wait a minute, what? Naomi Campbell uh, cares about aid reform? Well, yes, that's the whole point here. It doesn't matter what your job is. It doesn't matter if you're a parent, if, you, if you're not. The reality is uh, we're going to be hiring people, and so we have to have quality students who are coming out of schools. And so we're certainly happy to be joined here on Roller Martin Unfiltered by Naomi Campbell. How are you? I'm good, Roland. Thank you. It's good to see you. You too. Um, why is this issue important to you? Well, because I think... No, I think high school is very important. It sets the foundation for the rest of your life, for your communities, you know, for what for world young leaders. And so, you know, you've got your early grades, which are all great, but then you get to high school and you kind of see that the policy and it's a little old fashioned. It's very industrial. It needs to change with the times. It needs to be more modernized. It needs to see what's going on around the world. And therefore, then it sets the student. It's not saying, I'm not saying that educators aren't right. It's that just, it sets the tone for what the future is and what's going on in the world today. Um, I mean, I believe in what HQ is doing. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here. I think it's a great um, f uh, foundation for re imaging the policy of high schools and what education should be and what people should be learning and getting taught. Um, when you were in high school, yes, were you like, oh my God, this is driving me crazy, this is boring, this is, this is nuts. And I, I hear that from a lot of students. And, and part of the deal is folks have to stay engaged and if it's the same old, same old, people will check out. I have to tell you, Roland, I love school. I loved going to school. I loved wearing uniform. I looked forward to going to school. It was, for me, education is freedom. Oh, I did too. And but some of it was boring. Some of it was <laughs> boring, but some of it was boring then. But right. now when we look back at it, it wasn't boring. We, I'm happy that I learned and took in all that I did. It was important. When we talk about this, the sameness, that's also, I think, for me, the fundamental problem in this country in terms of this cookie-cutter model and the idea of being able to learn different ways. You've been a model for a period of time. 33 years. <laughs> and the reality, say it again? 33 years. <laughs> and the reality is, you, you work under different people who have different systems. Correct, and different education in different parts of the world. And it doesn't mean that that's wrong, but all of those different systems Help, help, help you to be where you are now. Correct. And for me, education is sort of the same way. One school doesn't have to be the same as Absolutely. the other. No, it needs to change with the times. Change is important. There's different curriculums that come in that needs to be accepted and embraced and taught to the students so that they can keep up with what's going on in the world today. It's For me, I find it, when someone comes up to me and says to me, Naomi, you were in Africa last week. Do they speak the same language in Africa? I'm like quite surprised and stunned like first it's a continent not a country it's a continent yes yes <laughs> and then they're asking me if they speak the same language no there's Swahili there's Afrikaans there's so many different dialects plus the tribal dialects all of this we should know this we should be updated basically it needs to be updated how do you also tell other individuals who have platforms who are prominent uh, who are celebrities, who are successful, that they have to also use their voice because, again, even if they don't have children, they're going to be hiring the folks Absolutely. who are going through these systems. Absolutely. We, I look at it this way. We are all a work in progress, and there's never a day where I don't want to learn something, and we should always look, that, look in that way of life. And I feel that, yes, we do need to use our voices. I was told by the great president, late Nelson Mandela, to use my voice. I didn't understand at 23 years old. Mm -hmm. I understand it now to help and make awareness of other things that you feel passionate about. And HQ is something I feel passionate about. Well, uh, same here. I think we can have a tremendous impact. Uh, it's just a matter of more people caring enough. And so Uniting. we really appreciate uh, you doing also. But before you go, yes. uh, I, you talk about uh, what you're working on YouTube. Oh, my YouTube. Yes, I, have, I did. <laughs> yes, I got it. <laughs> I have a channel that I started called Being Naomi. And basically, it was my way of just, get, I needed to give back to show what I do in my life daily. So this is the way I chose to do it.
And so, and, and so uh, I have control of it, and I just get to let people come into my life and see. You know, people think our lives is just glamorous. We just get in front of the camera, and that's it. No, I just cross four continents in a week. Wow. So yeah, I went Africa, Asia, France, London, here, and it's. I don't mind. I don't mind at all. When it's for something good, like I'm speaking it for the uh, Forbes Africa for the Women Summit. It makes it's it's what I want to do. So yes, I love modeling. It's been amazing to me, and it still is amazing to me. But I also the other side that I love that I'm able to get out there and speak for those that are not able to have a voice. Well, we certainly appreciate you using your Thank voice. Thank you so much. Uh, you want to support Roller March Unfiltered? Be sure to join our Bring the Funk fan club. Every dollar that you give to us supports our daily digital show. There's only one daily digital show out here that keeps it black and keep it real. As Roller Martin Unfiltered, support the Roller Martin Unfiltered daily digital show by going to rollermartinunfiltered.com. Our goal is to get 20,000 of our fans contributing 50 bucks each for the whole year. You can make this possible. rollermartinunfiltered.com.